of the day. Nigerians farmers' anti-corruption civil society organizations stomped the streets of Lagos and their numbers to protest against the politicization of the Economic and Financial Crimes Commission, disobedience of court orders and infringement on human rights of Nigerians. The protest was the third since the top activists began their call for the sack of the EFCC chairman, Abd Rashid Bawa. They alleged that EFCC under Bawa had turned itself into a set sensational media agency churning out deliberate misinformation on almost a daily basis to strengthen a political cause. We rely on the courts to adjudicate in matters of conflict between the people and the system. And any time anybody runs against the system, it's also the court that we adjudicate. But a, a, a situation whereby somebody is so powerful, somebody is so influential, somebody feels that he has, you know, a larger than life image, decide that he's not going to respect our law courts or the laws of the land. It's against the rules of natural justice. It's against the ethos of democratic practice. It's against the principles of human rights. If a, a, a competent court of judicial has given an order, it goes on the person that is, the social is given against to respect that order because he is also, he's also representing the government. If Bawa is the head of the FCC that goes to court to obtain court injunctions and court orders to detain and to prosecute perceived criminals in, in the polity, he cannot also continue to disobey the same court of law. If you must be beneficiary of court process, you must be willing to submit yourself to the same. For us, we have been worried, concerned, and our heart keeps bleeding. We first counted it, the first time, second time, and about two weeks ago, it became the third time that the chairman of EFCC, one of the institutions that is expected to assist us to tame the problem of corruption, being indicted by the courts, and unfortunately, it kept disobeying court order. Hello, hope you enjoyed the news. Please do subscribe to our YouTube channel and don't forget to hit the notification button so you get notified about fresh news updates.